problem 38 from chapter 20. A corner engine absorbs 52 kilojoules as heat and exhausts 30 kilojoules as heat in each cycle. Here we have two questions. The first question is calculate the engine's efficiency and the second question is calculate the work done per cycle in kilojoules. So here we have two questions. So we have to answer these questions one by one. First of all, we have to write the given first. So here they gave the information about the energy for the hot reservoir as well as the energy in the cold reservoir. So the energy in the hot reservoir is Q of H, which is equal to 52 kilojoules. We have to write these values in terms of joules as 52 multiply 10 power 3 joules. Likewise, the energy in the cold reservoir, QL, which is equal to 30 kilojoules. Likewise, if you want to write the values in terms of joules, we have to write 30 multiply 10 power 3 joules. Now, by using these, we are going to find the engine's efficiency. For that, we have to write the formula. The formula for calculating the efficiency of the engine is given by the relation epsilon or eta. So we can use any one of the symbol for the efficiency, which is equal to work done over hot temperature. That means the temperature in the hot reservoir. But here we have to modify this equation in terms of energy because here there is no information about the temperature we can convert this equation in terms of energy as efficiency eta, which is equal to the work done divided by the hot, the energy in the hot reservoir. And work done is the energy in hot reservoir minus the energy in the cold reservoir, or we can just use either L or C because L stands for low temperature, C stands for cold temperature. So both will be the same, better we can use Q of C, okay? So here divided by Q of H. Now I'm going to substitute the value for getting the answer for the efficiency of the engine. Now I'm going to substitute the value. The hot energy, the energy in the hot reservoir is 52 kilojoules. So 52 multiply 10 power 3 minus and the cold reservoir energy is 30 multiply 10 power 3 joules divided by 52 multiply 10 power 3. So here I got the answer for the efficiency as 0 0.423. If you want to write these values in terms of parcel percentage, we have to multiply with 100. So by that, the efficiency you can write in terms of percentage as 42.3 percentage. So this is the answer for the first question. Now in the second question, we are going to find the answer for the work done for cycles in kilojoules. So you have to give the answer in terms of kilojoules. So for that, we have to use the formula work done. So what is the formula for the work done? As we already worked out this formula in the previous question, Better we can just go back. You can see here the work done is nothing but the energy in the hot reservoir minus the energy in the cold reservoir. So I'm going to use only in the top of the equation. So work done, which is equal to QH minus QC. I'm going to use this equation for getting the answer for the second part. So work done, which is equal to QH minus QC. And QH is 52 kilojoules. So 52 multiply 10 power 3 minus and the cold energy that means the energy in the cold reservoir is 30 kilojoules that is 30 multiplied by 10 to the power of 3 which is equal to 22 multiply 10 power 3 joules we have to give the answer in terms of kilojoules 
therefore work done which is equal to 22 kilojoules where kilo stands for 10 to the power of 3 so this is the answer for the second question that's it thank you